Hello my friends, welcome to Talk To Me Tuesday for Tuesday, October 24th, 2023. This is Jennifer. Well guys, we're a week out from Halloween and so far this is the closest thing I have to a costume. Um, this was a shirt I made using my Cricut last year. It glows in the dark. It makes me happy. I had a pretty eventful week um, on Tuesday. I um, picked Jules up from the airport here in Austin and drove her to her sister's house, which is about two hours north of where I live. Spent a little time with them, came home again, spent the rest of the week helping my kiddo move. I'm almost done with that. I'm looking forward to, to them being all settled in their new place. It's pretty close. It's pretty close. And then yesterday, um, which is one of the reasons I'm so tired, this is not Jules's fault at all, but I went from, we did serious moving over the weekend, and then yesterday I drove back to Jules' sister's house and brought her back to Austin. We were going to try to go to Austin Creative Reuse, and I forgot they're closed on Monday, so that did not work out. But we did get to hang out, and then I got to, uh, you know, tell her goodbye one more time and send her on her way back to Albuquerque, where she safely arrived minutes before I fell asleep because I kept my eyeballs open just for that. I did finish one block uh, last week and then I have two more that are in progress. So this, these are Nandor's teeth and this pattern will go live on Fandom and Stitches and So Hooked on Friday. We've got Nandor, What We Do in the Shadows and Laszlo's teeth will go down here. That's Friday. So everything else is posted. I'm working on my You're Dead um, text that's actually I have it spread out all over my cutting table and uh, my sewing table right now so that will be hopefully I'll have some time to actually sit down and sew this week that'll be easy because it's two colors it's chain piecing so I can really knock that out pretty quickly once I have those two done I need one more bat and then one more block actually two more blocks over here and then my quilt top is done again all of the the patterns have been tested um, I've had some great pattern testers and um, everything's finished, corrected, going on the website and uh, Friday will be the last what we do in the shadows post for now, for now. I definitely have a list of things going, but those will be the last one for now because I'm going to need a break. The only other thing I have to show you guys is a sweet thank you gift that uh, Joel's sister Jan gave me yesterday. Um, I. She was very grateful that I drove Jules back and forth, though I will say it was no imposition to me to get to spend an extra, basically a whole day with my best friend. So it was like wonderful to get to see her last week and this week. And um, I don't know when I'll get to see her again. But anyway, um, yesterday when I went to pick her up, her sister gave me this, which is a little fuzzy prickly pear. I've never seen one like this before, but you can you can pet it. It's not prickly. And um, I love prickly pears in general. I have numerous growing in my yard. Um, they're um, native species, so they need like no attention, no care, very little water, and you just kind of throw them out there and they grow. But this one is gonna probably live on my desk or maybe my kitchen window, I haven't decided yet. So anyway, I wanted to share this with you guys. And it actually came from the market that Jules's nephew and his wife own, so. If you guys are ever in Clifton, Texas, which is um, west of Waco, about a half an hour west of Waco, they have a sweet uh, nursery and gift store there. And yeah, that's where that's where this little guy came from. I have uh, one errand that I need to run today. Um, we picked out a new floor and I'm going today to make our appointment. I have to turn the samples back in. I'm going to make our appointment to um, get that all scheduled. So downstairs. The goal is to have a new floor before Christmas. It's needed it for a long, long time. We still haven't unpacked like half of our stuff because we were waiting to get this floor done. So, so much of our stuff is still in the garage and boxes and I, that would be the best Christmas gift ever just to be able to finish unpacking. You guys, I hope you have a wonderful week. I hope you have a crafty week. I would love to see your videos. We've had some faces trickling back in and visiting us again. And I love, love seeing our Talk To Me Tuesdayers. If you're a viewer on YouTube and you would like to join the Talk To Me Tuesday community, I have a link in the description to go to the Talk To Me Tuesday WordPress. Everyone is welcome. The only thing you have to do to, to participate is send me a video so I know you're a real person. And then I will give you access to the uh, the WordPress and then you can share your videos there for all of the Talk To Me Tuesdayers to watch. Anyway, have a wonderful week, have a crafty week. I love you guys, see you next week, bye.
Thank you.